We see patients with shock every day in the emergency department, and while we do have a list of pathologies to work through, every once in a while we really have to think outside of that standard set of diagnoses. You're pushed in. away from infection, yep. pushed away from bleeding. Yeah, what uh, else do you want to know? I mean, I guess I should have asked it right up front. What medications does the patient take? Yeah. You mentioned avascular necrosis. Yeah. That makes me think steroids, but what other medications is she on? And maybe that's what the issue is. So she's on a whole host of like the typical autoimmune medications for lupus and Sjogren's. She'd obviously stopped any NSAIDs prior to the surgery. And yes, she's been on prednisone five milligrams for over 15 years. So chronic steroid user. Yeah. Okay. So I, I yeah. think based on that, I'm going to do IV antibiotics. Right. I don't care that there's a fever or not. Like I'm worried about the immunosuppression. Yeah. So I'm going to throw IV antibiotics on board. Absolutely. But the, the other thing is if she's on chronic steroids and she just had surgery. Is this just like a poor stress response?